Welcome back to CDV News. So how do you feel about seeing middle-aged people sporting Lycra, you know, on their bikes around Christchurch? Well, he's one of New Zealand's most well-known actors, and he's back in the Garden City doing just that, singing and performing his latest show. Very interesting indeed, but he's got a message to send to middle-aged men who like Lycra and prostate checks. Here's Jared McCulloch. He's a man known by many in Kiwi households, appearing in Peter Jackson's Hobbit and the King Kong remake. And now he's back in Christchurch taking his and playwright Greg Cooper's extraordinary new performance to the stage. He is the middle-aged man in Lycra. It's a bit of an effort every night, obviously. Hour and a half on your own and ten characters and making sure you get it right. The show opens on Sunday night as part of the Christchurch Arts Festival. I'm doing three weeks at the court straight after we're doing the two-week season at CAF too, which is very exciting. So um, it's going to be five weeks of uh, one-man show, um, which is like unbelievable, but it's so exciting. I'm, I'm actually really enjoying it. Hedlow says the art scene in the region is flourishing, but time is what's needed. I think it's got a, a decade to go yet before it's really back on its feet. Um, not that I'm any uh, foreseeable soothsayer, uh, but you know, I think the energy of Christchurch people is extraordinary. Um, what I am liking is seeing people actually coming back to live entertainment. You can't beat it. Book for something at the CAF, anything. We saw a new production, you know, Greg Cooper's new production of That Bloody Woman in the weekend, a rock opera. Unbloody believable. Um, and Greg's written my play, so it's fantastic. So now he's taking on a one man show, a new challenge. I have to, um, because otherwise you become complacent and you flatline, and um, we're very good at flatlining. Oh, let's just leave it the way it is, you know. Uh, if, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah, but trouble is, if it's not broke, it stays the same and you flatline. And um, so I think we need to challenge ourselves all the time. In the show, it features an important scene, taking a look at prostate cancer. Hedlow is the face of this month's Blue September Awareness, getting those over 40 to get a checkup. In my generation, don't go to the doctor. They're really staunch. You know, geez, I don't want to be sticking anything up my bum, you know. Oh, no, it's, uh, I'm a man, you know, I don't need that. Well, actually, it's changing. You need to. We, Anyone post 40, even before, you need to get the PSA and you need to get um, uh, an examination. Prostate cancer is the number one cancer in New Zealand men. It kills about 600 of us every year. That's about the same number of women who die from breast cancer. I know a lot of um, friends who have lost their fathers and brothers and and uh, who, who have been affected by prostate cancer. And um, so it's not a, it's, you know, if you can get onto it earlier, um, it, there's a possibility of, of, of saving your life. Well, there isn't a possibility, you will save your life. Hedlow says the next step is to get the checkups made free, but getting along to the GP is the immediate step. I um, go and visit Phil Wong every year and I say, hi Phil, I'm here, um, I'm ready, let's do it. And um, whether I bend, squat, use uh, the supine option uh, or I lie on my side, I don't care uh, as long as I, um, I get an examination and I think it's that easy. Getting comfortable at the doctors is one thing and for the show it's another. The performance will be hitting Christchurch for five weeks. Encourage uh, your mates, you know, uh, any colleagues I come across who, have, um, who I'm working with who are post 40 and I say, have you had the finger? Awkward. Jared McCulloch, CTV News.